Do you think Mario Draghi will hold off, hold the cowbell off the table until 2016 as leading euro air area data is accelerating on the upside? This may, of course, put euro USD up on up a dollar soon and create a reversal in European stock markets and potentially in America as well. A little bit of a mouthful, but it's basically... Yeah, and there's, a, there's a mouthful and there's also some false uh, data in that statement. I mean, if, if, unless, and I don't mean to be critical, but that doesn't, didn't the question preface it by saying that euro data is accelerating? Yes, it did. As, yeah, leading euro area data is accelerating on the upside. Do you think he'll okay, hold so off? For, so for those of you that are into the multimedia experience of Hedgeye, I'm going to tweet right now the European economic data of the day, which is unequivocally red in rate of change terms. So that, you know, A, is not true. Uh, and B, the, the, the kind of kind of eradicates the rest of the question because you can't preface it by saying growth is accelerating. Yeah. Uh, but, you know, what you would say, you know, the, the bigger question that we're going to debate with people who aren't long Europe, um, which is where you should be, European equities, that is, is, is do you cover or not ahead of Draghi going dovish? Um, Draghi's commentary now is going to start to reflect the German concern. So, um, and again, the German economic zoo index, which you can see this morning, which is an October number, uh, is the worst number we've seen by far of the year. So that's a pretty good leading indicator. You can look at the current situations index there. You can look at expectations. It's just, you know, bombed out. Um, maybe not bombed out. It looks like it could be going into what we think Europe's going to be in as a recession. And, you know, that's the bigger question is when does Draghi get it? And do, does the Bundesbank become more dovish than Draghi? Um, at a 0, 0.0 CPI number, which is, again, you know, again, not to pick on the, the, on the question, but I do think it's important to, to, to call it out for what it is. You know, German CPI was 0, 0.0 this morning, and that's not an acceleration. Um, and the Bundesbank eventually is going to be knocking on Draghi's, you know, Italian villa door and say, hey, you know, bro, we need some. We need some cowbell, bro. And when when Draghi looks at him and, and says, "Okay, I can do this. I'm the man," you know, then then, then the euro is done going up <laughs> versus the dollar. I don't know what day that is or what month for that matter, but uh, I think that that's the biggest risk uh, to a lot of things. Because don't forget that that would be a huge dollar up move instantaneously because it would be euro back to like 110, 111, which is the current low end of the range. But the bigger question is, can he get it back to 105? which is where we said it could go before um, at the beginning of the year when we introduced uh, you know, really the Draghi tripling down as an idea. I think in the next three to six months, he, he effectively has to go, and the Germans are going to force his hand.